Was locked up. Pilots ready for flight. Drivers behind the line. Match number 54 in three, two, one, go! And they're off and running as all the bots move forward. 44, 68, 54, 82, and 45, 16. Gain five points. Blue Alliance gains 60 points for delivering the gear and starting the rotor as a 75-10 advantage as now the second rotor, as now the rotor goes into operation for the Red Alliance. 39, D1, now dancing around the middle of the field as the second rotor starts for the Blue Alliance. The Red Alliance trying to get the gears up. They have one gear in their gear set to start the second rotor. They need one more as the Blue Alliance now has two rotors turning. They need three more gears in order to start the third rotor turning. Two of them being placed right now. One more gear delivered to the Blue Alliance airship will get them a third rotor in operation if they can place it properly. As 5482 travels down the field with a gear in their possession, they move to the airship. They are now at the far side. They are at the lift peg. They place the gear onto the lift peg. The pilot lifts the gear. Pilot now has it, places it, is it into the gear set, turns the crank. The third rotor turning another 40 points for the Blue Alliance. 100 fuel elements now out onto the field. S 3091 dances around in a neutral zone, 5482 in a blocking position, trying to keep the Red Alliance from gaining those valuable, valuable gears. Another gear being delivered to the Blue Alliance. They need six gears to start that final rotor in action. They just now placed two more. As 4730 tries to deliver another gear to the Red Alliance airship. The pilot signals for them to move a little move forward as they're trying to deliver. We're under 30 seconds left to go. 180 to 50 in favor of the Blue Alliance right now. As a red bot, 3091 climbs up into the airship, signaling that they're ready for flight. That's an additional 50 points. None of the Blue Alliance bots have started climbing yet as we're down to five seconds left to go. 44-68 races against time in order to get their air. Yes, they do, right at T0. 44-68, Fernbank links. All right. The referees have done their little quick review of the field. We have a score. Here they go racing into the clouds one more time as the Blue Alliance crosses the line victorious with a 230 to 100 victory. All three members of the Blue Alliance move up in the rankings as 45-16 slides into the number two ranked position. 44-68 Fernbank Lynx climbs into the top ten. 40, 54 of 74 matches now complete. Folks, after this next match is over with, that will be the final match of the day.